Hi, hello, namaste. This is Yashayka from DSM Academy. So today I'm back with a video which is for business statistics, second uh, business statistics, which is for fourth semester students. So those who are new to my channel, please do like, subscribe and share. And today's topic will be one of the important topic. This question will give you around 16 marks, 12 marks long answer type and four marks short answer type from this chapter. And the chapter name is regression. So here, let's start the video. Regression. So here, regression analysis. The, what is the meaning of regression? Regression in simple form, it is called as prediction. So one known value will be given. From that known value, an unknown value have to be calculated. Right? So regression ka matlab hota hai ki bhai predict karna. Ek value diya jata, o value ke hisab se apan Dusra value, malum kar lena. Ante, e regression lain jasta ante, regression meaning e ante, oka values is sad koni variables ve, avidis koni, eve te manamu, fi prediction jasta manamata itla undo chu and jepi prediction jagalave, the regression ante. Regression simple form lay mantam, prediction good anach. Regression is also called as prediction. So here, the meaning for regression here is, regression analysis is a statistical device with the help of which we are in a position to estimate or predict estimate or predict the unknown values of one variable from values of another variable so known values say unknown value variable malum kar sakenge apan so known values unknown values of one variable to the known values of another variable right so here directly coming to the topic in examination he will ask you compulsorily regression problem only right so how to solve it basically with a simple sum i'm going to explain you and practice more further sums 100 percent you will get full marks from regression so before going into the problem let's start with the formulas so here regression x on y bhi rehta, regression y on x. Yani x ke deke y find out karna hai, y ka diya to x find out karna padega apne ko. So, let's start with the formulas. I'll write the formulas. Then we'll solve a problem. So, here the formulas. Regression equation x on y. So, x minus mean is equal to r. Correlation coefficient. r ka matlab hota hai, correlation coefficient. So, standardization x by standardization of y into y minus mean. So, ho gaya. So, this is mean, this is y ka mean hai, x ka mean and isko batate apan regression coefficient x on y. Right? So, this is also called as bxy. We can write as bxy. So, next is regression equation y on x. Chodandi, kada regression equation x on y anna pudu. Formula is the x minus mean is equal to r standard deviation of x by standard deviation y y minus mean. Regression equation x on y unna put ide formula use jala y on x unna put e formula use jala. Basically again that x on y unna put x to start ite thi y on x unna put y to start ite thi. So ikkada x pi naos sadeo koil x on y ante ikkada nemo y pi naos sadeo koil y on x ante. So samajh jao beta yaha pe right. So next is mean regression coefficient on y on x so isko batate apan byxb so r is equal to correlation coefficient uska formula hai r is equal to root of bxy into byx right so abhi x sum solve karenge apan so here we'll start the sum find regression equation from the following data age of husband and age of wife is given let us assume it has x and this has y so, first we have to calculate the regression equation x on y and also regression equation y on x and also correlation, coefficient of correlation. So, here first x values we will write 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26 and 27, right. So, next y values y values are 17 17 18 18 19 
19, 19, 20, 21 and 22. So these are y values. First what we have to do is we have to find out small x. Small x we can find from x minus mean. So, पहले आपने को mean find out करना है. मना क्लास टू mean find out जाल सोचते हैं. So, mean एट फाइंड आउट जैसे हमाओ. First, we have to total this. Sigma x. So, we'll total 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. 225 is the total. So, now x mean is equal to sigma x by n. So, 225 divided by how many numbers are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 divided by 10. Mean is how much? 22.5. Stop. Right. So, 22.5 is mean. So, 22.5 यहाँ पे ले लो. 22.5 दिस कोण निकाला. नेक्स्ट ये एक्स वाई ले रहे थे उन्हें इन लोग के लिए मीन माइनस जिया ला एक्स में से मीन को माइनस करना है तब स्मॉल एक्स आता तो इसका मतलब 18 माइनस 22.5 माइनस 4.5 माइनस 3.5 राइट 20 माइनस 22.5 हाउ मच माइनस 2.5 माइनस 1.5 राइट 0.5 ओके नेक्स्ट 23 माइनस 22.5 हाउ मच प्लस 0.5 Okay, next 24 minus 22.5, how much? 1.5 plus, plus 2.5, plus 3.5, and plus 4.5. Yeah, yeah, small x. Now we have to square this. 4.5 into 4.5, how much? 20.25. Next, 3.5 into 3.5, 12.25. 2.5 into 2.5, 6.25. 1.5 into 1.5, 0 0.25. 0 0.5 into 0 0.5, 0 0.25. And 0 0.25, 2.25. Yeah, okay, 6.25, 12.25, and 20.25. Okay, so now we'll total x square. Okay, so 20.2, uh, 12.25, 6.25, 2.25, 0 0.25. So the total of sigma x square is 82.5. Chalo, I see karte hai ban, y ka mean find out kari hai. Okay, so y total is how much? Sigma y here, 17 plus 17 plus 18 plus 18. Uh, plus 19 plus 19 plus 19 plus 20 plus 21 plus 22 190 so 190 is the total here so mean y mean is equal sigma y by n so here 190 divided by 10 which is 19 okay so up here 19 yaha pe likhenge now from y value we have to minus mean so x my y minus y mean okay so 17 minus 19 in the early would y mean gonna put another what i think it was is going to be y value on g mean value minus g 17 minus 19 minus 2 minus 2 minus 1 minus 1 0 0 0 20 minus 19 plus 1 21 minus 19 2 22 minus 19 3 right so now this total is how much 3 4 5 6 and here 2 to 4 5 6 0 right next sigma y square it's got square getting it 2 2 is 4 2 2 is 4 1 1 is 1 1 1 is 1 0 0 0 1 1 square is 1 2 square is 4 3 square is 9 total of y square okay so how much 4 plus 4 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 4 plus 9 24 next x into y so small x into small y so 4.5 
into minus 2. 4.5 into 2. How much? 9. So, both are in minus value and after multiplication it will be plus 9. Next, 3.5 into 2, 7. Next, 2.5 into 1, 2.5. And 1.5 into 1, 1.5. 0 0.5 into 0, 0. 0 0.5 into 0, 0. 1.5 into 0, 0. 2.5 into 1, 2.5. 3.5 into 2, 7. 4.5 into 3, 13.5 so now the total for sigma xy 9 plus 9 plus sorry 9 plus 7 plus 2.5 plus 1.5 plus 2.5 plus 7 plus 13.5 so it is 43 okay so now we have to first we will calculate regression equation x on y so regression equation x on y so for that x minus mean is equal to right r standard deviation of x by standard deviation of y into y minus mean this is a formula okay beta? so here we don't know the x value here okay so x minus mean we know it mean of x is how much 22.5 so 22.5 is equal to r regression <coughs> quotient of correlation regression kya hai? R value, so standard deviation x y, standard deviation of y, R standard deviation of x y, standard deviation of y into y we don't know and what is the mean value here? 19. So here R coefficient of correlation can be calculated by this. Yep, total jo bhi hai, the formula calculate So here sigma xy by sigma y square so here y minus 22.5 is equal to sigma xy is how much 43 43 divided by y square is how much 24 okay so into y minus 19 understood so next x minus 22.5 is equal to 43 divided by 24 how much 1.7916 right y minus 19 now x minus 22.5 is equal to multiply with y so y into 1.7916 minus and this multiply with 19 so ye isse bhi multiply hoga isse bhi multiply hoga so 1.7 1.7916 into 19 34 Point zero four, right? <coughs> X, ye my, uh, leke jo number, to kya ho jayega? Minus value plus ho jayega. So X is equal to Y 1.7916 minus 34.04 plus 22.5. Okay? So, minus uh, 22.5 here. How much? 11.54. So X is equal to y 1.7916 or else you can write it as 1.7916 y minus 11.54 this is regression equation x on y right next we will do regression equation y on x regression equation y on x so y on x formula kya hai? y minus mean is equal to R standard deviation of y by standard deviation of x into x minus mean, right? So here, what we have to do is directly y mean ka kita hai y mean ka 19 value hai 19 is equal to r r value anto ondi. So r ka dm jisko chu we can write it as sigma x y by sigma x square. So x on y karte time x on y jisita pude mo. Ikada y square of sadi, y on x just put x square of sadi, y on x karte tempe, x square likna. So up into x minus ye x ka mean, kitna hota, x ka mean kitna hai 22.5. So now, so y minus 19 is equal to sigma xy is how much 43 
divided by x square is how much here? 82.5 y minus 22.5. So divide 43 divided by 82.5. So how much? y minus 19 is equal to 0 0.5212 into x minus 22.5. Right? So multiply this with x and also this with 22.5. y minus 19 is equal to 0 0.5212x minus into 22.5. How much? 11.7272. Right, beta? So, abhi karna kya hai? We have 19 carry jari kada. So, 19 kudar likhe ge to kya hata? Minus 19 plus ho jata. Y is equal to 0.5212x minus 11.7272 plus 19. So, how much? Right. So, here y is equal to 0.5212x minus 7.28. So, एक एक नंबर का फर्क हो जाएगा तो कोई दिक्कत नहीं है 1.7916 कैन बी रिटर्न 1.792 आल्सो ओके सो नेक्स्ट इज r अगर पूछा तो करना है अगर अड़ूते नहीं जाए ना एंड दी r वैल्यू फाइंड आउट जाए ना ओके okay, ना सो so, r वैल्यू इतना अड़ूता डू एम जे कानू कोमल अड़ूता डू क्या बोल के पूछेंगा r R is equal to root of B X Y into B Y X. So B X Y का मतलब होता है, this can be written as B X Y, right? So this value can be written as B Y X. So here R is equal to B X Y का value कितना है? इन तो चिंदी, right? 1.7 root of 1.792. We can write it as, okay बेटा? So into 0.521, 0.521. Okay, R is equal to multiply this. Okay, so 1.792 into 0.521 root of 0.9336. So, is ka root karo? R is equal to 0.966. So, this is quotient correlation. Right. So, बाकी के sums practice करते रहो, related sums 100% exam में ऐसा type का sum आएगा, which is for 12 marks and short question में जो है, quotient of correlation का sum आएगा, which is for 4 marks. So, we have covered 16 marks. So, keep watching the videos. फिर मिलेंगे next video में. Your Shaker signing off. Bye.